On November 3rd, 2011, a new era in environmental responsibility and sustainability began in Leon County, Florida, as the Eastside Branch Library opened its doors to the public. The county has been a, a leader in sustainability and sustainable practices, and we think it's important that we uh, show in our own buildings uh, how to do that. And when people come to the county for a permit, we thought it was important to be able to demonstrate to them how to utilize different sustainable best practices and show them in use. So we could point to the East Side Branch Library and say, here's where you can go see those in use, from the grounds to the materials to the systems that are in place here at the Branch Library. So we thought that that's important for us to, to demonstrate personally uh, our use of sustainable practices, as well as to be catalytic in, in our approach to um, advancing these sustainable practices throughout our community. At the very beginning, uh, we reached out to the community and their input went into the programming of this facility. One of the changes to the original program was the addition of the request that we adhere to lead criteria, leadership and energy and environmental design. And we decided that we would get at least a silver credit uh, level. And in fact, we achieved gold, the, the next highest above that. So the building met all of their criteria plus some. You have a lead silver, gold, and platinum. And it simply speaks to the level of incorporation uh, that the building has with, with respect to the best practices of sustainable design and engineering. Very early on, we had a conversation about a building that had a sense of place. We wanted a building that would feel comfortable in Tallahassee. We wanted it to be a place where patrons would enjoy coming, a place where they would uh, feel very comfortable, like their living room, sitting down and reading. Uh, we didn't want it to be uh, a place where you felt like you had to grab a book and leave. This is a beautiful library building. It's open, it's welcoming, it's serene. You can sit inside and enjoy the air conditioning and the natural light coming through our solar tunnels. You can sit outside and read a book and overlook the pond. I, I hope that for the community it becomes a destination, a place that they'd love to come and look forward to visiting.